Deep Japan. Today I'm here at Miyama Village, famous for such roof houses. You can time travel back to 200 years ago. Cut! Japan has two faces modern Japan and traditional Japan. And it is hard to find the original village in Japan. But Miyama in Kyoto is the right place where you can visit the real old village without time machine. This village has another name, Kayabuki no Sato, which means the village of thatched roofed houses. This village is not the Disneyland. All of the houses are the original old farm houses older than 100 years. And there is no admission fee. Uh, the person you meet there is not Cinderella, but the elderly village ladies. The animal you meet there is not Winnie the Pooh, but a real bear. At least, I met a monkey. The business model of this village is very interesting. All the 50 family invested their money and made their own company called Kayabuki no Sato. And this company runs the parking lot and the guest house and the souvenir shop at the parking lot. With this profit and the support from the local government, they keep their houses, which cost a lot to maintain their roofs nowadays. And now this village is getting popular as a sightseeing spot. Great idea, isn't it? All the villagers can make money and all the houses are kept beautiful and it also gives them job opportunities and pride as a villager in a traditional community. If you live in a traditional town, why don't you make your own company all together with your neighbors before it gets too late? はい。うちはね。まあ、夜になってね。で、来たので。はい。ほんで、あの、街灯つけたんですね。ああ、熊よけに。うん。ほんじゃ、それから金だのに、この間人一回来ました。はいはい。I met a monkey.
This is Miyama Folklore Museum. You can go inside an old farmhouse. This is a storehouse. Costumes for the festival. They kept a cow for plowing here. This is a barn. This is the uh, garret of the thatched roof house. Toilet. They grow Japanese silver grass or reedy at riverside nearby. It is a material for the roof.
How did you like Miyama Village? I hope you like it. See you soon. Bye. Ah!